Hello guys, it's Ojoizi. In this video, I'll show you another method of installing VirtualBox guest additions on your PyroTOS installation of VirtualBox. Now, this is different from the method we used in the previous tutorial where we installed VirtualBox guest additions through the terminal. In this video, we will install VirtualBox guest additions from the ISO file. Now, this virtual machine was one we created in the previous tutorial. We already have PyroTOS installed on our VirtualBox. If you missed that, I'll leave links to the, in the description to that video. Okay, now let's go ahead and install VirtualBox installations from the ISO file. So, the first thing we want to do is to attach our VBuzz guest additions ISO file to this virtual machine. And to do that, click on devices and insert guest additions CD image. Now when you do that, nothing will seem to appear. But go into uh, your file manager, which is this places link up here, and you see VBuzz guest whatever the uh, version of your ISO file will appear right here. Now click on this to open it. And what we want to do is to right click and open the terminal. Now press ls to list the content of this directory which is media um, cd room 0 and the file we want to work with is vbus linux additions run but we want that file in our root directory not on our uh, user we have here so we're going to change into that user by typing sudo su then go ahead and type in your password okay now that we've um, switch user to our root user we're going to list the contents of this directory one more time because right now we are copying this vbus linux additions.run file into our root user directory and to do that type in cp vbox linux additions.run and this t that sign and press enter and we're going to change directory into our root user directory now if I list the contents of this folder, we'll have vbus linux additions right there. So what we're going to do is to make this, um, you know, this file executable. And to do that, go ahead and type in chmod plus x and the name of this file. I press enter. The last step is to execute this um, file and run it. And to execute files on Linux, type in dots forward slash the name of that file and press enter. Now, this is going to go ahead and install VirtualBox virtual bus guest additions. I'll be back when the installation is done doing this thing. Okay, the installation has completed. Now, what's left is to reboot the system. Go ahead and type in reboot now. And voila! There you have it, on Pro Reboot, the window um, adjusted to full screen. Now when I type my password, we are brought to the home screen. Okay, but if for any reason your screen your screen did not adjust to full screen mode, what you do, just come into devices, no I'm sorry, come into view, switch into full screen mode and switch back out using the your right control key and letter F. And that will fix whatever bizarre um, thing going on with virtual bus guest additions. Alright, thank you guys. That's all for this tutorial. See you on the next one.